Hey there guys, and thank you for coming back to my review channel for today's review. It's blue, it's probably going to rot my teeth out from the inside out, but let's try this. Sunkissed Berry Lemonade. I love lemonade, to be honest. And Sunkissed, they seem to make a lot of lemonade flavors. They are also, in my opinion, one of the leading companies that makes orange soda. Although Crush, in my opinion, is a lot better. We're not here to discuss orange soda, though. We're here to discuss berry lemonade. So let's look at the nutrition facts, and let's get right into it. Berry lemonade soda flavored with other natural flavors. Contains no juice, and it's caffeine-free. That's pretty cool. Serving size is one bottle. Calories is 270 calories. Total fat is zero. Sodium is 105 milligrams, 4%. Total carbs, 73 grams, 26%. Total sugar is 72 grams, includes 72 grams of added sugars for 143% of your sugar intake for the day is this bottle. That's 143% of your sugar intake. That That's crazy. That is nuts. Protein is zero. Not surprised there. Uh, it doesn't say anywhere on here that it contains bioengineered food ingredients, which is always nice to know. Uh, Sunkiss Growers Inc. and Dr. Pepper 7-Up. I had no idea that Sunkiss was a Dr. Pepper 7-Up product, but that's cool. Um, let's get, let's crack this baby open. I got this over at 7-Eleven. Uh, they had this on sale, two for three fifty. I got this and I got something else, and something else will be in a later review. But, wow, this is really giving me a hard time opening. Ooh. That is very, very pleasant. Very, very loaded with sugar, too. Oh, my goodness. They advertise that it's new. I personally have never seen this before. Uh, when I saw the blue drink next to the 7-Ups and the orange sun kiss, I said, you know, I've never seen that before. And I'm almost positive you guys have not seen this either. Something new. sun is branching out, and they're going with a berry lemonade. The initial taste, you taste a lot of berries. Um, I would predominantly say blueberry. They do have blackberries there too, so I, I would assume it's a blueberry-blackberry mix. I predominantly taste blueberries. And the lemonade finish is so tarty. If you're somebody who enjoys like a, a, a sour... If you enjoy uh, Sour Patch Kids, you'll like this. It's good. It's pleasant. The finish is a, a refreshing lemonade. It's good. Because there's a lot of sugar in it, it's very difficult to chug this. Um, but that's also a personal thing. I'm sure if you were really thirsty and this is all you had, you would drink this like it was going out of style. Um, but I just, I can't. There's so much sugar in this. I'm looking at it now, 104, just looking at that, I'm like, oh my goodness, I got a sugar headache right now thinking about that. 140, I'm going to consume it. Because this bottle is going somewhere today. And uh, I'm going to finish this off throughout the day. Um, Just wow. God, like I said, I got this at 7-Eleven. Paid about three. I want to say it was two for three fifty. I got this and something else. And uh, yeah, I'm happy with it. I think it was a good purchase. Would I buy it again? That's the question. Would I buy it again? If I had Meg with me and Meg was interested in trying it, I absolutely would buy it again. Personally, myself, though, I'm going to skip this one. Uh... Like I said, there's a lot of sugar in it, and sugar for me, I'm just, I need caffeine. I don't need sugar. <laughs> That's really what it comes down to. Um, as always, guys, my name is Johnny5. If you enjoyed this review, as much as I enjoyed shooting it, you give me a thumbs up. You show me some love in the comment box down below. If you are new to this channel, it's the first video you're catching. There's a lot more content coming up, and you do not want to miss a thing. So make sure you subscribe in the corners, and you ring that bell. Daily uploads here. And uh, I will catch up with you guys on the next one. Check the description box for Jay Gleaves' channel. Be good, be safe. Later, taters.